I'm in Japan at Fuji Motor Speedway. We're deep in the catacombs here. You'll hear cars racing by. We're in a locked garage. Because what we have here is a car that is not yet being released to the general public. It's the new Lexus IS. And uh, no, that's not some new Andy Warhol paint job. This is just disguise. This is what they do. This is, they don't want anybody to see this car, but uh, for some reason, I'm getting to see it first. So it's pretty exciting. Some subtle changes in the car, and we'll go over those in just a minute. I'm with the uh, chief uh, engineer of the car, Mr. Furuyama. How are you? There's, now, there's only so much you can tell us. Can you tell us much about the car? Okay, see, there's not a lot he can tell us. Top secret. I know the wheelbase is maybe a little bit longer. Okay. Uh, it's got the eight-speed transmission in the base model now. That's standard, right? Um, I think it's going to be a lot sportier car. For example, let's say uh, you got a family, you got your kids strapped in the car seat. When you start drifting sideways, those kids aren't going to move around because this chassis is incredibly rigid, correct? Well, I know it's 306 horsepower. I know that. Anyway, it's a little longer wheelbase. I'm, it looks to me to be about 70 millimeters. Not, not that much longer, but just enough to give it a little more rigidity. Anyway, this is the car. The grill, a little bit different. It's camouflage, but you can see it's a little bit different. But uh, it's going to be a very exciting automobile. Look, let me ask you this. Are you, uh, are you happy with what you've accomplished? Oh, and he got something. Got something there. Yeah. yeah. I think he's happy. Let's take it for a ride. Well, I kind of see why they call this their BMW fighter. Because when I was getting interested in cars, Germany was always the standard. And everybody tried to beat it or match it. And this feels very German in its handling. Uh, extremely powerful engine, eight-speed transmission. Boy, it handles very nice, and it has that, uh, that Lexus sound, you know. Uh, the, the ultimate is, of course, the LFA. That just is like a symphony, and all these, all these engines, it sounds like a V8, although it's only a V6 with 306 horsepower, which uh, nowadays doesn't sound like much, but that's pretty impressive. You know, it handles better than most probably race cars did from 15 to 20 years ago racing sedan. It's amazing what electronics and, and uh, computerized suspension systems can do. I mean, it's, it doesn't lean, it doesn't roll, nothing flexes. The brakes are pretty incredible. Uh, there's obviously no fade of any kind. But I think the fun thing is you've got a sports car hiding in a sedan. And obviously you can do things on this track you wouldn't do on the street and you shouldn't do on the street and it's fun to take a, a car to its limit or close to its limit this car obviously has camouflage all over it but you get a basic idea what it looks like this car will be out in uh, 2013. it's fun to get kind of exclusive and, and see what the future is going to be uh, pretty impressive